I'm Rob Whitfield with the Orange County Register and welcome to OCN2 for Wednesday, June 17th. United States Customs and Border Patrol is crediting new technology, increased manpower and word of mouth for a 17% drop in foreign nationals caught illegally crossing the U.S. border last year. Border apprehensions dropped to a 36-year low in 2008, according to statistics issued yesterday by the Department of Homeland Security. Homeland Security statistics show that 723,840 people were apprehended in 2008, down from 876,803 in 2007. Nearly 1.2 million were apprehended in 2005. A 37-year-old teacher at Corona Del Mar High School is out on bail after he was arrested last week on suspicion of furnishing marijuana to a minor. Newport Beach police said math teacher Chad Edward Smith was arrested last Thursday after the parent of a 16-year-old discovered text messages about the teen smoking marijuana with Smith. According to police, the 16-year-old, a student at Harbor High School, met Smith outside the school system and Smith likely provided and smoked it with the teen at least once. Smith was placed on paid administrative leave and is out on $50,000 bail. North Orange County motorists will soon get some relief as transportation officials prepare to reopen a section of Imperial Highway where a new bridge is being built over railroad tracks. While two northbound lanes have remained open, southbound lanes of Imperial Highway between Orange Thorpe and La Palma in Anaheim are scheduled to reopen June 19th after having been closed since February for the construction of a bridge that separates rail tracks from road traffic. The $90 million project is part of an effort to reduce delays of up to 10 minutes each time trains pass through. Officials say about 80 trains pass through that intersection each day. OCTA estimates 46,000 vehicles traveled in the area near the intersection in 2006 and expect that number to nearly double by 2010. Gas prices have returned to $3 a gallon in Orange County. However, the Auto Club says retailers seem reluctant to raise prices to more than $3, indicating that prices may be nearing a peak. On June 19, 2008, the cost of gas hit a record high of $4.60 a gallon. Clear blue skies and a warm sun returned to Orange County yesterday after being gone for much of this month as crisp onshore winds cleared away the clouds. There have been days when the sun has broken through, but we haven't had a prolonged period of clear sunny skies until yesterday afternoon. Today should also be clear and sunny for most of the day with temperatures in the 70s. Gulliver's Restaurant in Irvine is hosting a prime rib eating contest tonight. For 29 bucks, the challenge is to eat as much as you can in 30 minutes without vomiting. The competition starts at 6.30 p.m. with a 32-ounce boneless prime rib. Gulliver's manager expects the winner to down at least two or more servings. First place gets $400 cash, an overnight stay at Radisson Newport Beach Hotel, two Angels tickets, and dinner for two at Gulliver's. And you can read more about all of these stories and get your breaking news all day at OCRegister.com.